If you're noticing that your Ford may not be accelerating the way it used to, there's a chance that the throttle position sensor needs resetting. If your Ford throttle position sensor is not working properly, it can cause all sorts of problems with your car. But you shouldn't wait until the issues compound before you act, because resetting your Ford throttle is a simple process that can be done in just a few minutes. In this video, I will show you how to reset the throttle position sensor in a Ford so that you can get your car running smoothly again. How the Ford Throttle Works To understand how to reset the throttle position sensor in your Ford, you need to know a little bit about how the throttle works. The throttle is what allows air to flow into the engine so that it can combust and produce power. The amount of air that flows into the engine is controlled by the position of the throttle plate, which is opened and closed by the throttle cable. The throttle position sensor is what tells the computer how far the throttle plate is open. This information is used by the computer to adjust the amount of fuel that is injected into the engine. If the throttle position sensor is not working properly, it can cause all sorts of problems with your car. These problems can be anything from a slight loss of power to completely stalling the engine. In some cases, the check engine light may come on as well. Tools you may need when resetting the throttle position sensor. Before you start resetting the throttle position sensor in your Ford, there are a few things you will need. You will need a pair of pliers, a screwdriver, and an engine control module fuse if you are going to use the battery cable method. Check the video description for links to these products if you need to pick them up. In a case where you are using the key method, you will just need a screwdriver. You will also need to have your Ford manual handy so that you can locate the fuse box and the throttle position sensor. How to reset the throttle position sensor. Resetting the throttle position sensor is a simple process that can be done in just a few minutes. Step 1. Find the throttle position sensor. The first step is to locate the throttle position sensor. In most cases, it will be located on the side of the throttle body. If you're having trouble finding it, consult your car's service manual. Step 2. Disconnect the electrical connector. Once you've found the throttle position sensor, disconnect the electrical connector from it. You may need to use a pair of pliers to do this. If your car has an electronic throttle control, there will be two connectors. One is for the throttle position sensor, and the other is for the throttle actuator control. You only need to disconnect the connector for the throttle position sensor. On some cars, you may need to remove a cover to get to the connector. Once the connector is disconnected, you can proceed to step three. Step three, unhook the negative cable from the battery. For trucks that have a traditional throttle cable, you can unhook the negative cable from the battery. This will reset the throttle position sensor. But for cars that have electronic throttle control, you need to remove the engine control module fuse. This will reset the throttle position sensor. Step 4. Remove the screws. Once the battery is disconnected, you will need to locate the two screws that hold the throttle position sensor in place. Remove these screws and carefully remove the throttle position sensor from the engine. Once it is out, you will need to clean it with some carburetor cleaner or a degreaser. Be sure to clean all of the dirt and grime off of the sensor so that it will be able to work properly. Step 5. Reconnect the battery and start the engine. After you have cleaned the throttle position sensor, you will need to reconnect the battery and start the engine. The check engine light should come on for a few seconds and then go off. If it does not, then you will need to take your car to a mechanic to have it checked out. Useful tips to prevent throttle position sensor problems. There are a few things that you can do to help prevent throttle position sensor problems from occurring. One, regularly clean the throttle body and sensor. This will help to prevent dirt and grime from buildup and interfering with the sensor. Two, check the throttle position sensor for damage. If you notice any cracks or damage to the sensor, it will need to be replaced. Three, make sure the throttle cable is adjusted properly. In case the throttle cable is too loose, it can cause the sensor to give incorrect readings. 4. Keep an eye on the check engine light. When the check engine light comes on, it is an indication that there may be a problem with the throttle position sensor. Do you have to reset the computer when resetting the throttle position sensor? After you have disconnected the battery, you will need to reset the computer. This can be done by simply disconnecting the negative battery terminal for a few minutes and then reconnecting it. As for resetting the throttle position sensor, this is not always necessary. If you have cleaned it and made sure that it is not damaged, then you should not have to reset it. However, if you are still having problems with the sensor, then you may need to take your car to a mechanic for further diagnosis. 
How do you calibrate a throttle position sensor? When you need to calibrate the throttle position sensor, then you will need a special tool called an electronic throttle control actuator. This tool is used to manually open and close the throttle body in order to properly calibrate the sensor. In case you do not have this tool, then you will need to take your car to a mechanic. They will be able to use the actuator to properly calibrate the throttle position sensor for you. What happens when you disconnect the throttle position sensor? When you disconnect the throttle position sensor, it will cause the engine to stall. This is because the sensor is responsible for sending signals to the engine control module that tells it how much fuel to inject. If there is no signal being sent from the sensor, then the engine will not be able to function properly. This is why it is important to not disconnect the battery or sensor, unless you are specifically instructed to do so by a mechanic. Where is the throttle position sensor located in my Ford F-150? The throttle position sensor on a Ford F-150 is located on the side of the engine near the throttle body. It is a small black box with two wires coming out of it. In order to access it, you will need to remove the air intake ducting that is in front of it. Once you have done this, you will be able to see the sensor and access it easily. Do you have to recalibrate the throttle body? In most cases, you will not have to recalibrate the throttle body. However, if you are experiencing problems with the throttle position sensor, then you may need to do this. To summarize what we talked about in this video, the simplest approach to reset your throttle position sensor is to unhook the negative cable from your battery for up to 5 minutes or remove the engine control module fuse. Make sure you have the required tools before you begin, and it should be a quick and easy process. I hope this video helped. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and follow so you don't miss any of my videos.